thanks for tuning in again. Um, I have a new thing to unbox, and before I get to that, uh, I just wanted to say that I've had a change of heart uh, about some of the things that I ordered from Banggood. Um, I mentioned in previous videos that because they weren't able to deliver the crawler that I had ordered, I had no use for the winch and the motor and ESC that I had also ordered with it. Since I've actually thought about it, that's not really true. I do have a use for them. And because I'm still gonna get a crawler, so I've decided not to ask Visa for the refund um, on the winch and the motor and the ESC, because in reality, I mean, sure, I have a right to, but I always like to do what's fair. Regardless of how I was treated about the whole crawler thing, it's still not fair to not pay for something that they already shipped me. So, and yeah, if they had responded instead of ignoring my request to cancel the other stuff, it could have been canceled on time. But you know what? I'm happy it's not. And now that I've actually thought about it, I'm happy that I'm getting these other things still. So anyway, what's fair is fair. I'm gonna let Banggood have their, you know, their payment for this because let's just face it, that's what's fair, right? And I'm still expecting the ESC and the motor and I, and I am excited about getting that stuff as well. And I have picked out another crawler and I'm excited to take you guys along uh, for the ride when I go to pick that up as well. So lots of good stuff. I, I'll start this by saying thanks for sending me this, Banggood. Thanks. Anybody who is affiliated with Banggood, I never meant any disrespect to you guys. You guys are doing a fantastic job. And if Banggood is helping you guys, then they're doing a good job too. And just because it didn't work out for me, you know, I always say everybody deserves a, a try at least, no matter how bad they screwed up. So give them a try and hopefully you'll have a good experience. Let's get into this now. So this should be my winch. Ha ha, yes it is. Beauty. Beauty. Anything else in there? That's it. Beauty. All right. Check this thing out. Oh, can you see that? Check it out, guys. That is serious. It's like all metal. There's no plastic on it. And it looks like a real winch. It doesn't have any bulkiness to it. Of course, it's got its own uh, switch. I think it's a three-way switch. Yep, yeah, it's a three-way switch. So middle would be off. And then this would be one way, and then this would be another way. That's awesome. So I don't even need another channel, really, to run this. All, I need, all it needs is its own battery, and it could be completely separate from my uh, electronic system, which is really what I was happy about. Oh, this is easy. Oh, there's tape on this. That's weird. It's like somebody cut the bag open and then taped it back closed. Whatever. Whatever. Here it is, guy. Oh, oh what happened? Correct me if I'm wrong, but this should be connected to this, no? Ew. Um, I don't know if this is right. Am I supposed to solder this to this? Because in the, in the picture, it, it was attached. And this, the back of the, the back of where it connects to, there's like, there's damage. It looks like damage. I 
That's weird. It looks amazing, but I don't think, I don't think this is right. Other than the, also this package, look, it was already cut. And it was held together with tape. There's the mounting hardware. Oh, weird. And the bottom of this, the mounting bracket that comes with it, it's all scuffed. Like it's already been on a vehicle. I don't know if you can see that. Let me see if I can bring it around. Look at, see what you guys see. See if I can get it focused in here. Sorry, my light is not very good. Look at that. It's like all scuffed. Like it's already been mounted to a vehicle. That's weird. I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be brand new and not like reconditioned or anything like that. And I'm pretty sure the wire is supposed to be connected to it. Look at the end of this. Let's see if I can focus. Can I focus that? There we go. You see that? It looks like it's been melted. And one of the wire posts, there's like barely a post there. The, the one that you're looking at right now on the right, there's looks like a dab of solder there still. But the one on the left is like missing. Look at the melting on the back. What's going on here, man? This is brand new. Man, I can't catch a break. Man, I hear about their uh, good customer service, so I, I hope they're willing to do something about this. Oh man, I can't catch a break, guys. I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be connected and I'm pretty sure that shouldn't be like all melty back there and missing the post. How, did, how does this happen, man? Oh, I, got, I came with the hardware, I came with everything, but... Oh, well. It's not like I needed it right away anyways, I guess. Sorry guys, <laughs> I was really excited and I... I don't know, I just can't seem to catch a break, man. Oh, guys. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for shipping this Banggood. Um, I really love the looks of it. I really think it's really cool looking. And I really hope you're willing to do something about this. I hope this isn't the way it's supposed to come. I, will, I hope there was a mix up or something like maybe someone who sent one back to be reconditioned, somehow it didn't get reconditioned properly or something and it got back, put back and I don't know, but oh God. Oh man. <laughs> um, I'm reaching guys. I want to say a lot. I want to say something positive. I really, really do. So uh, I'm just going to stop this video now. <laughs> um, I got to contact Banggood and see what they're willing to do for me. Anyways, uh, give me a thumbs up, please. I need a thumbs up at least. Um, if you're not already subscribe and hit the bell and you'll be notified to my next <laughs> video. Uh, and, uh, yeah, <laughs> sorry, man. Keep on RCing, keep on keeping on, guys. Ciao for now.